Yeah, no, you ain't no psycho You're not like the others, no No changing behaviors Not sure how to act around you hi guys and welcome back to the black beauty tv welcome back to another interesting banger hey kenya and the swam we remain gallant in kenya nobody can take us away from kenya as long as i said hey i still did there i am there gallant anyway guys we are back again with another video like we like nothing ever happened mm? I don't want to waste time because I don't even want today's video to be long. I came out today to make this video just because of one thing. But before we go into that story, anyway, guys, uh, who made it to the carbon? Dim one go of Kenya. Hey, guys, she made it. Shan Arwa, she's also a Kenya. So we are in Kenya and Jamaica. Eh, gong gong to gong gong. Uh, she's now in Jamaica allegedly, but not allegedly. Uh, it is what it is, guys, with uh, Agama Lizard. And um, whom again? <laughs> gigolo master of all gigolos. I think maybe we'll just do gigolo very little. Castro Castra is back. <laughs> Castro Castra said that she was to buy of depression. Guys, depression is real. So this is sickness. We don't need to laugh about it, you know, because it can happen to any other person personally me the black beauty tv guys if you have been watching my video i hate it when you when there is something that you cannot control something that has to do with sickness i don't like laughing at people with those whether you have one eye you have one leg you have one toe you have there are things you cannot control you yourself and you do not buy those things with money so as in my carbon when you are sick something mm -mm, we don't joke with it here so I just want to say Castro Castra is back. So let us allow her to heal from the depression. And I always say that I hope she is fine and she will come back healthy. And I thank God that she's um, she's out of it now. Like she's working on it. What I go? Mm -hmm. So, and we're going to be talking about Jamaican uncle. Bomba to bomba on this. Kino Jamaica uncle uh, with day on their head. Guys, let me tell you guys the truth. Do you know something? Honestly speaking, I was saying that mm -mm, Black Beauty TV, because of all that was happening on YouTube Street, that betrayals here and there, and you know, we are human. There is no how you will not feel somehow. I don't want to come here like to pretend to you guys that, oh, mm -mm, it happened, everything. Like we just say like this and we are gone. Nobody won't fight. We are here on YouTube Street, you know what, to just deliver and we go. But some certain times as a human, <laughs> things always come between human beings. So, and when those things come is the moment of maybe you might be down in some, uh, for some reasons, but you don't need to give that thing a chance in your life. So I was thinking today, like, because of the things happening on YouTube, you know, uh, friends betraying friends uh colleagues betraying colleagues misunderstanding here and there and that 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 a lot a lot a lot so i was telling myself like i think i need a break from youtube i just don't even want to see anybody let me just like go for swimming guys i can really swim very very well yes since from childhood uh i came from a village where at the back of our house, we have very big river. So as children, we always, from there now, mm -hmm, I know how to swim very well. So I wanted to go for my swimming. I want to go for uh, bike riding. I can ride bicycle. I want to go for bike ride. I can even ride motorcycle for those of you who doesn't know. Mm -hmm. I can ride motorcycle very, very well. Since from like when I was, uh, I think 17, 16, I started riding motorcycle it is what it is so that one also i can do it very well i wanted to go um for i wanted to visit friends i want to go to a restaurant with friends eat food go for a dance you know something just take care of our drink for at least once in a while do party i just wanted to allow youtube to be let me just face another life let me try let me in fact let me go out with friends that they will be begging you to do things together and uh, you always say oh you don't have time because when you come to your workplace you are here 
trying to give your subscribers water, 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 water. Because we used to laugh here. Mm -hmm. We used to do, and it gives one joy to do reaction. But when here and there misunderstandings start coming, reaction doesn't give that kind of joy. Reaction is a good thing. It's very, very good. And I love doing reaction. There's no way I'm going to stop doing reaction. But I think in life, sometimes we just need to like, you know, just take a break from things, from friends that doesn't even watch you in this world, you know. Just take your break from everybody and face your life because you are the only person that will give yourself joy in this world. So that, that is really, guys, what I wanted to, like, do today. Mm? Like, if I come back, I'm just going to, like, maybe today go for swimming. Tomorrow, if I come back, I go for, like, go to a restaurant somewhere with friends. And next tomorrow, you know, you go for, weekend is coming, you go for dance and all that. Mm? You drink, you come back home. Eh? I'm not somebody that drink like that occasionally. I'm a drink, yeah, like, I drink occasionally and not much. And I drink only wine. I don't drink any, or I don't drink uh, beer. Sometimes, like, there's one beer they call Rattler. We always buy it when we are celebrating, like, Christmas and all those things. So, one, I used to drink like that. It's something sweet like that, but mostly I drink wine. Mm -hmm. So, it is what it is. But now, after I plan myself to do this thing, uh -uh, this is our YouTubers, our uh, followers, sorry, our subscribers. You guys know what to let the Black Beauty TV rest. They call share me one video i don't want to even do reaction about nobody know any reactor doing reaction about reactor face your problem let the black beauty tv face their own but all i have to say i don't want to say much eh anybody anybody that want to bring something on youtube if you want to bring a video and start talking about people on youtube you have to be 100 percent sure of what you are saying so that tomorrow you will not come back and start changing and already i told you guys i always use their words Eh, to react <laughs> and you are saying that we should leave kenya and react or in nigeria and whatsoever i told you guys when are you guys going to learn this thing in your head that see even some re, some kenyan said that they claim they are our subscribers when i see them like this insulting the black beauty tv in swahili i used to see your comment i have a lot of kenyans that even translate it for for me i say oh black beauty see this subscriber i say leave them let them enjoy. If I'm nobody, nobody's going to talk that way about me. So I am also selling the market for them. So allow them. It is what it is. But you see this Kenya, we are not leaving it to us. You think, oh, when you don't know that uh, before there was no reactor in Kenya, we are the ginger of these reactors in Kenya. So I will be the one. In fact, I will remove you even from your country and do reaction on top of your head. Mm -hmm. Go and react on Nigerians if you, you people have the power. Mm -hmm. It is what it is, guys. I don't want to waste time on that one. I just want to go straight to my reaction. I don't know what I should start reacting on. Agama Lizard live stream that I watch. Oh, she's talking about she's not together with Kino. She don't know how Kino's wife will be feeling. But no, I don't want to start on that one. Where I want to start is Jamaica Uncle Yaman. Yaman, my brother from Jamaica. Hey, today I want to give it to you, bomba to bomba. Nobody should come and tell me anything. No. I'm just a reactor. As I always tell you guys, I am just a reactor, so I react on any video I want to react, whether in Jamaica, in Africa, in Europe, in America, if I see. We used to react. Even these Kenyan people, they react on Ivan before. Ah, Ivan is from West Africa. Why are you people confusing this world and be saying, oh, we should not? Don't react. Is Erondante from Kenya? You guys are reacting about Erondante. Erondante does not come from Kenya now. So, guys, we are not here to do all those brrrra, brrrra, brrrra today. Mm -hmm. If you have eyes, you have eyes. You see how far what is happening. But you know what? We are here to ginger the ginger. So, yeah, man, my brother from Jamaica, uncle, hey, the CEO of the Lazy Gang. This Lazy Gang, you people cannot destroy it in Jesus' name. Hey, something that I created with my hands. Mm -mm. Guys, I don't want to keep playing like this and be doing like I don't know what I'm going to do. Yet, on a serious note, guys. Mm -hmm. So, what am I saying? Yeah, man, I saw Kino and Dimwango. This is where I'm going to start. Doing charity in Jamaica. Hey, guys, I was surprised. Because all this while, guys, I used to think, honestly speaking, pardon me, I have not traveled the world. I'm not the wild, wild, according to Dimago, wild, wild mm -hmm, traveler. 
wild wild or that worldwide <laughs> according to our gamma legal that she say wild wild traveler so i'm not a wild wild mm -hmm, traveler so i don't know what is really happening in other countries but you see this jamaica I used to see Jamaica like, oh, Jamaica. In fact, the way Jamaica sometimes they are talking, you will say that Jamaica, they don't even have poor people at all, at all. Only for us to come and see our Jamaican uncle just giving a Kenya one driver like this. He will just, he give Gitriba $1,000. He's giving this one $500. The other one, $200. I say, hey, Jamaicans are rich. I'm not saying that there are no rich people in Jamaica before. You people will come and misunderstood me. There are a lot of rich people in, in every country in this world. Even in Burundi, that is one of the poorest of the poor. Mm -hmm. There are still riches of all richest people in Burundi. So I'm not saying that there are rich people in, uh, in Jamaica. But what I'm trying to say is that I used to think everybody in Jamaica is rich. Uh, that was what I used to think, guys, you will not understand. Till I start seeing this Kino lifestyle, a big Kino life, a big Kino whatsoever in Jamaica, doing this uh, charity work in Jamaica, now with Agama Lizard, the people they visited, how these people are suffering in Jamaica, guys, you will not believe it that this is Jamaica. And Jamaican mommies, Jamaican daddies are removing dollars to give rich people in Kenya Jamaican uncle, you came all the way from America to give somebody that is doing well in Africa to deliver money for them. And your people in Jamaica are suffering like this. Are you not a hypocrite? Don't you see all those sofa sofa people in Jamaica? Now you came to Africa. That's why I used to tell you guys, you people don't used to understand what the Black Beauty TV is always saying. Validation. People always look for this thing. Especially when they see where people are already gathering. <laughs> when they see that people have already made it, they are gathering. They want to show their face. They want to even show, okay, me self, let me go to this particular place and show myself. Let me show them that I am among the richest and I want people to recognize me. That is why people don't even go to the poorest of the poor to do the charity. They claim that they are doing charity. Instead, they go to the richest of the richest and start doing this charity anyway guys i don't want to keep paragulating you know what hey, let us go sharp 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 and watch kino lifestyle in jamaica shout out to you guys though in jamaica but if you have not watched this video guys let's watch and see how people are suffering in jamaica and check out what uncle is doing the uncle from jamaica left all the way from the u.s to come and do to richest people building houses in africa People building mansions in the swamp. Do you know how rich you are if you build your house on top of water? <laughs> Lambruski, Lambrosco, and Uncle came doing this thing, charity to the rich in Africa. And people are dying in Jamaica. Uncle, are you a hypocrite? I know you came to enjoy, but you should have come to enjoy Africa and be wise. Have that wiseness on top of your head. Know that if somebody is rich this way, you don't need to. You need to check out the poor in Jamaica. Guys, let's go and watch them. Watch I go. It's me, Daughter of the Soil. If you have not liked my video, kindly like the video before we go, guys. And if you have not subscribed to my channel, kindly subscribe to my channel. I love you guys from the depths of my heart. Woto, woto. So let's go, guys. Check it. Is that the hospital? Yeah, yeah. Now get big. Is that big size in there? Okay. 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 Yeah. 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 Mm -hmm. You got shot coming out. I'm always work and everything, you know. It was an intense violence was going on in the community. Here? Yeah. yeah. How much years ago now? Four. Four years ago. The mm -hmm. violence was really intense them time. Yeah, and you get cars in the middle of it. So everything good though. I go on all up. 
Thanks, thanks. Yeah. Thanks. Yeah. You want a soup to drink now? Now? You can't give me tip. What it in there? You can't tell the better what it in to. Red pea soup. No, the best that drinking. Huh? The best. What in it it in to? Oh, it's in a one one bowl. Uh, I can take it then. Yeah. Open it for you now? Yeah. Yeah. So yeah. Sit down yeah. up a bit. Sit down up. All right. So there we so we have some pull-ups here. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. As well to from um Karen. Yeah. I know and I think this is some hmm? some uh, I don't know what it is. It's some pressure thing uh, from Karen from the US, you know, for the Pampas. So you can just tell her thanks. Well, on behalf of the Irish Shadow Golden Age home here in Trenchow, we appreciate this you sent for us, Karen, and we would like to tell you thank you very much for all these pampas, because the home here need it at all times. Yeah. Uh, you know, it's held on the first of the real pampas. So we appreciate this. Mm. Okay? So, my brother, Jamaican Yaman, hey, you have become a Yaman in Africa. Me, I'm, I'm so happy that you visited Africa. I don't have anything against you visiting Africa. Because guys, you know, sometimes if we do these videos, a lot of people don't really understand what we are talking. If you don't listen very well, if you don't have, in fact, if you don't have wisdom, you will not understand what we are saying. Let me put it clear to you guys that me, I like what he's like. I'm so happy he's in Africa. He's enjoying his life. Honestly speaking. I want to see somebody go to Africa and be free like that. And I'm not against Jamaica uncle helping people in Africa. But what I am against is not my money, but I'm a reactor. I'm just giving my own thoughts. You understand? So people need to understand. I'm not saying he must do what I am saying, but I'm just giving my own sense. Like, no poor people, no poor person in Yabohanze has gotten help from Jamaican uncle. One worst thing is that he takes, he collects his money and he's giving to people that already have. If this Jamaica uncle is in the village in the Yabohanze helping, like, let's say, elderly women that maybe they have nobody, widows, you know, really children that don't have anything to eat, they need money to go to school. I wouldn't be, I, in fact, I would not sit down here and say, why don't you go to Jamaica help? But why will you come? Leave all the poor people in Jamaica. You are thinking you are coming to Africa to help poor people in Africa. And Africa, what are you helping? You are carrying Marwa and the gang, all of them, to go for safari. After all the money you gave these guys, the first day you came to Africa, all the GoPro cameras you gave these guys in this village. After all that, Jamaica uncle, the food you have cooked for these guys. In fact, all those YouTubers, all of them, they got money from you. Imagine, guys, he give Gitriba $1,000, Jamaica Okul. Do you know how many poor people you would have helped in Africa with that? In fact, only $100. Do you know how many people you would have put food on their table? You don't know. That is why I'm asking myself, how can a grown-up papa like this, you carry your... Because you, want, you know what? You want these people to run around you. They, they only do this thing not because they want to do charity. They do this thing just because... They want people to recognize them. On top of it, after giving them all that, GoPros, money, blah, blah, gifts, clothes, and all that you bought from the U.S. You went ahead. Be cooking for them how many times? Even the food they ate on Easter day, minerals, everything, is you, Jamaica uncle. You are a visitor. At least, Kenyan people, don't you people feed your visitors? Or let me say Marwa, because... I don't like generalizing it, honestly speaking. Don't you people feed your visitors? Some of them will say, oh, when visitors come, they bring something. Once the visitor come, after bringing something, the visitor will also be feeding that family till he leave. And this particular person will travel as a Kenya. That he said that, oh, even Marwa himself, let me tell you guys. You know, we say it in my cabin the way it is. We don't care how we paint them. He said that as Kenya. As Kenyans, when they go for a visit, they bring something and give the people they visited. Guys, since Marwa has been visiting people, 
Have you ever seen Marwa take something to go to that place and visit and give the people? If I have not seen, maybe you have seen. Guys, can you please tell me or show me the video that Marwa brought things from Kenya or went for shopping for all this family he visited? If really Kenyans are like that, that's why I always say they are hypocrites. People are hypocrites. When they are looking for lies to cover lies, they will begin to say like that. If Kenyans really are buying gifts, to go and see visitors. Why is it that Marwa has never bought anything to visit somebody? At the same time, he's the one when people want to visit him, they must, in fact, they must go bankrupt. I heard some people, they were able to say in the comment section that ja that jacket, Marwa stole that jacket from Richard the Traveler. I never even know the story that he stole that blue jacket. That Richard the Traveler came out and said that Marwa stole his jacket. What a shameful Thing. But I'm not after, I don't know why I always refer, that's why I told you guys that any reaction I refer back to the swamp, what I go. So this is my thought about this Jamaican uncle. Maybe you Jamaican uncle, if you are not looking for something, you will not do like that. Look at the poor people in Jamaica, poor elderly people in Jamaica, they need pampas. Only these pampas they need and you are there. You know how, how much this U.S. Uh, 1,000 US dollar. It's not even 1,000 because she shared a lot of money. Do you know how many people, if you say you want to help poor people, and you'll be saying, yeah, man, yeah, man, and God will help you. If you really want God to help you, go and do it the right way, my brother. Huh? I'm not against you doing charity, but do it the right way. Anyway, it is what it is. As we are still in this Jamaican something, this Shan Arwa or whatsoever, me, I'm a reactor. I'm just reacting. I don't care about this thing. I just deliver my stories and I'm gone. She's lying that, oh, she's not going to Jamaica. Well, already Agama Lizard has told people that you are coming to Jamaica. Agama Lizard has already even posted you and her in Jamaica. So what is the lies about that you are not in Jamaica? If you people don't want people to know your ways, talk to your friend. Let you people not even say anything. Don't even show people. Till maybe when you are in Jamaica, you tell people, okay, I am in Jamaica. What I go? And now and again, as we are talking about them, before we even go and watch the clip that Dim Wango said that Shan Arwa is coming to Jamaica. Huh? I don't understand how oh, African tea is uh, also now in Jamaica. Huh? I don't know what. Now, imagine, let me, in fact, let me give it to you guys, boss boss. Look at Kenyan people. Kenyan people telling people that don't react on Kenyan reactors. Go and react on Nigerian reactor fire. Burn anybody that say that thing. Why is it that Dimwango and the rest, why is it that they don't stay only in Kenya? Is Jamaica Kenya? Has Jamaica become Kenya? Why is it that your people, your bloggers, they travel to other countries? I saw one comment section in that place telling the person that all the money, all the help in that village, does not come from Kenya, and it's true. How many people from Kenya watch you guys? All those help, all those GoPros that you have, how many Kenyan person bought those GoPros for you people? All outsiders. I will teach you how, I will teach you guys in this carbon how, in fact, this is your tribalism, you are talking about Kenya. You will stop it from me, the Black Beauty TV. I will deal with you guys about this tribalism. If any time you bring this tribalism, Go and rethink in your head and ask yourself, oh, this village that they're saying, Iyabohanze, Iyabohanze, how many, how many Kenyans even know this Iyabohanze? How many American people watch you guys? How many people from the UK are they Iyabohanze people? If you are confused in your head, go and reset it. Now, Dimwango, African tea, they are in Jamaica. They went back to Kenya. They could not even stay, two of them. African tea, I don't know if she will stay one week, two weeks in Kenya. The same thing with Dimwango. She did not even reach maybe two, three weeks in Kenya. She's already back to Jamaica. Coming to Europe is Europe, Kenya. If you people don't want anything to do with people outside, I've told you guys. You see, I said that some subscribers, they used to insult me in Swahili. I saw their comment, guys. I saw you people, and I still see you guys in my channel. What a shame. Are you guys not ashamed of yourself? They still come to my channel and type. When they go to other people, even though the channel is speaking English, they will be talking about Black Beauty in their Swahili, but they are still here typing on Black Beauty TV, thinking that Black Beauty TV will not see those things. And there are no Kenyans.
to translate those things for me. Me, I always say that that is how confused people, that is how confused human beings behave. And let me correct and reset your head. If you don't want Nigeria people to talk about you, Kenyan people, <laughs> tell your Kenyan bloggers not to travel to anywhere. Let them stay within Kenya and do vlog. There are beautiful places in Kenya. Why can't they show us all those beautiful places? A tourist country for that matter. None of you, Kenya, have ever come out to do very beautiful vlog about your country. None of you have come to big chairs and say, oh, look at how um, Kenya look beautiful. You always walk on the street of Nairobi. Go to Nigerian bloggers and see. Go to Tayo Aina. Go to this thief. Watch their video and see how they have shown the most prettiest place, how they have made vlogs about their country. Even at the same time, sometimes they insult their country, but they make beautiful vlogs. Tell your, this your YouTubers to learn how to promote their country. Uh -uh. Let them promote Kenya. Kenya is beautiful. A lot of people here, do you know that, guys, a lot of patients in the hospital, when they see me like this, they'll ask me, first thing, where are you from? I will say I'm Nigeria. Have you been to Africa before? They'll say yes. So to Kenya, eh, almost all of them, they'll say they have been to Kenya. All over the world, Kenya is a popular place. But they are vloggers. They can never show you anything good about Kenya. They are running to other countries just because of views. We are not saying don't go to other countries because of the views, but at least try and show us the beauty of that safari land. Let us see the beauty. Imagine even common Maasai Mara. Marwa cannot even video beautiful videos, uh, videos and show us. You are running to Jamaica. Imagine African tea in Jamaica. After going to Jamaica, Dimwango, after going to Jamaica, they are running back to the Caribbean. Is that Kenya? Now, and if I react on them in the Caribbean, you say we are reacting about Kenya reactors, uh, Kenyan vloggers. Fire burn you guys. Reset your head. That, you know, guys, I don't want to classify these Yabohanze people as Kenyans. I don't classify them as Kenyans because they think differently. I'm sorry to say this thing. Because if they think as normal Kenyans think, they will not say this thing. Kenyans are all over. All over the world. Is it their country? Why don't you tell them to go back to their country? That's why I say I don't want to classify this Yabohanze as Kenyans. Anyway, guys, let us go and watch that small clip of Shan Arwa. And then we come. Mm-hmm. Like the video now, don't make me to be provoking. Like the video, like the video. Thank you. It's me, Doctor of the Soil. Baby, baby. Empress. Yes, baby. <laughs> and Empress. Yes, Empress. And everything. Hey, the hey. You get the royal treatment. When Sean will come here. Hey. Oh, Sean. <laughs> I go mash up the place. Hey. <laughs> the trouble. I'm telling them, you. Them don't know the thing, go. They soon know. They this place looks nice. Mm -hmm. Let me finish up the vlog right here. Yeah. Melissa! Oh, Melissa! Melissa! <laughs> oh, what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? Guys, <laughs> never ending saga. <laughs> Melissa! <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Lambrusco, Lambrusco. <laughs> Shan Arwa, you didn't know that your friend Dimwago was going to say it in a video that when you come to Jamaica, you plan you were going to Jamaica, you should have just, in fact, me, I don't want to be wasting my time on this clip. I just want to show that clip as like, you know, uh, this is my evidence. If it is my evidence, I need to show my evidence. So next time, if you are planning anything, tell your friend never to say it anywhere. You know, we... We like to dig sometimes, so because when we dig, this video did, did it somewhere. Anyway, there's something I, I, I was, I really wanted to like pick from that video also. You see the uh, Kino calling Dimwango Empress, baby, and all that. And then why do you, why wouldn't you expect people to say that you are dating Dimwango? Now Dimwango go to her video, was really ranting. Oh, she don't know how the, uh, Kino's wife. Or you know, girlfriend, whatsoever, baby mama will feel like if they hit like this one that people are talking that she is dating with Kino. Which woman on earth, guys? Me, the Black Beauty TV. I will not do it to her. 
If I see my man with another woman like this 24 hours, <laughs> now, in fact, me, I will not take it all. I will not be happy. Mm -mm. Except if you don't love that person. If you love that person, guys, you will be jealous. So. <laughs> it's natural. So tell me which woman will want the husband or the baby daddy or the whatsoever. She said that at the end of the day, the Kino goes home, goes to his girlfriend. But the whole day you spend with Kino. So what do you expect from people? Me, I don't have anything against a woman and a man. They are just normal friends because we have them plenty. I'm not saying that when a woman and a man, they are just normal friend, uh, friends, people must suspect them. No, people must. People don't need to suspect them. But there is a way that people do things that people will suspect to people. You know, it's the same thing that Jigolo Master was doing with Casta. At the same time, having Mickey Mouse. You can have a, a girlfriend, even you, you can even know that Kino have a girlfriend, but you can still accept to sleep with Kino. You are not children. What I can so don't come here and be ranting, ranting, ranting. Of course, Kino, Kino's wife is going to be angry. If she's not angry, then she doesn't love the Kino. And imagine, no matter how, whether you are doing YouTube content or you are doing whatsoever with Kino, you travel now, you go back to Jamaica to collect another woman's man, and you are working with this man 24 hours. He only goes home to sleep. So Kino don't even have time for his family. What if his family want to go and do something? The daddy is not there. The daddy is a, a, a gigolo. is a boy boy to a woman that left home and came back for the second time in, in the Caribbean, in, in Jamaica. What are you doing in Jamaica for the second time? And took another woman's man to be running, to be... In fact, how many months is Kino running you in Jamaica now? In fact, that woman is even a mumu. The woman is even a mugu. How can you allow your husband... To work with this woman like this up and down months in Jamaica. This is not normal. I'm sorry to say it. People, be, people can be friends. But not friends that you are working with a man every blessed day. Is there nobody in Jamaica that is single that can even show you around? Must it be Kino? Is in Kino car you are using 24 hours? Who picks his children from school? Who, buy, who go to the market? I don't know. Maybe the wife have another car. I don't want to judge. But... What is the use of Kino as a man if he have a wife at home? What is his use? His use is just to produce these plenty children. Uh, Kino, your use, you are, in fact, don't allow me to even say you are a non-entity father. Because which father that the children are sleeping is when you go home? We, you know, we will always react no matter how you people turn it around. So let's go and watch them guys and we go and watch a grandma lizard, not Kino. And then we see if we can do gigolo or we call it a day. You, you guys have never heard me saying me and Kino we are dating. Like, when did I say that? I've never said that. I've never said that. And I haven't introduced nobody to you yet. Please, why can't you guys keep calm? I know it's good, you guys, you are concerned. But every day, hey, you, D and Kino, you are dating. There's something happening. Like, it's even so hard to convince you guys that you are not dating. Seeing me with him for quite some time, you know? And you guys are now assuming things. But now this is not okay because <laughs> because now the other person behind the bars feeling pressured and everything like this guy every day D and Kino dating D and Kino dating and everything. And it's not the case. Like it's not even good. Even for Kino's girlfriend. I don't know how it, it is like for her because it's crazy. Like honestly it could be so much for her. You know, because you guys keep on saying, oh, but why can't we just, just respect the fact that Kino has a woman? And he even told you guys, you know, like, it's crazy, but I'm just here to ask you guys, like, why? Like, why can't we just take it easy? Please, stop putting us together. Please stop putting us together, you know, as a couple. You understand? Even if we look like we perfect match for each other. Oh, my God! Lambruski Lambroska. 
ah, fireball them every time and every day. You know, sometimes people that don't really have sense always speak this way. <laughs> you are concerned of what, about what people, how Kino's wife will feel, and people should feel and think about how Kino's uh, baby mama think. You that you are carrying Kino and gallivanting around, don't you think, don't you feel for the woman? You want people to feel for the woman, but you that is the one, the ginger of all everything. You that you are the one that has carried her husband. You are not concerned how she feel. You don't think how she feel because if you think how Kino's woman feel, you will not be gallivanting whole Jamaica with Kino. If you feel for Kino's wife or Kino baby mama or Kino gigolo, if you feel for that person, you will not be attached to Kino like this because you will respect the fact that Kino is with a woman. But because you don't respect the fact that he's with a woman, you can call him anytime you buy food, you are the one cooking, food, you are Kino eating, and then you think you, you are telling people to think about how the woman feels. We that we don't even know whether he have or he don't have. How do you want people to feel? You that you are in that shoe, you should begin to feel it and let Kino go. Let Kino go to her, to his uh, wife or gigolo mama. You understand? that In that case, people will know that you have feelings for, like a human feelings for this woman. But as long as morning, afternoon, evening, Kino is with you. Kino always only goes home at night. Uh -uh. You don't care. So how should we care about it? How she feel? You that you are the one doing it. Me, I'm not doing it. I'm just talking online, doing reaction. You that you are the one holding Kino's, Kino holding your back, like his girlfriend. Why can't you have mercy on the wife? Why can't you have mercy on the baby mama? You already know that Kino is a, a father Abraham, father of many children. He need time for his children. Yes, he need the money for his children at the same time. He need time. It's not about just hammering a woman and producing children. Pew, 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 pew. You also, children also need your attention not to go home only when they are sleeping. So allow Kenu to care for his family. Mwatago, guys, I want to leave Agama Lizard for now because if I continue to talk, I don't want this video to reach uh, um, maybe one hour or something yes i know we know we like the ginger the long video and all that but at the same time me in particular i don't like it when it's too too long so let's go and watch gigolo gigolo the mad boy hey the mad boy yabohansi is also making his ways to go to jamaica you are deceiving people oh you want to he said now you say you cannot give up leave whitey let me see what you will eat somebody that is jobless school you did not finish you did not do anything, only this diploma you went and was doing wuru wuru. You never go even attend classes, even for one day. Now you come, oh, in fact, let's go and watch Gigolo and his, uh, his sugar mommy in America. His richest sugar mommy. <laughs> Western women, the richest women in the Western world. Let's go and watch him, guys, and we come back and call it a day. Day one, huh? Eh? My rich mom, I see her on the building. <laughs> <laughs> I see my rich mother in the building. She stays in the US, Brooksy L. Wow. It's a big blessing having many mothers around the world who support David Jr. I'm grateful, guys. So these are the memories like I've really built on these YouTube streets, you know? And for me, I feel so good. Yeah. Thank you, mom. Big shout out to you, Brooksy L. She's my rich mother. <laughs> I know the haters don't like that, but uh, it is what it is. It is what it is, yeah? True story. She's my rich mother. One of my rich mothers that I have around the world, in which I'm so happy. I feel like to have her on these YouTube streets. <laughs> I'm saying the
There's a not there's a new song <laughs> from Nigeria. They call it now Brotherhood. <laughs> I hope Jigolo can. In fact, if Jigolo can listen to that pigeon English of that musician in Nigeria, portable, he sang it for one cross man. I've been a cross lady. I don't know dresser. <laughs> oh my God! When I hear this song, I remember my. My brother, Jigolo in Kenya. I said, Jigolo in Kenya, have you heard a brotherhood song? <laughs> you belong to the brotherhood. Let me tell you the truth. <laughs> you are a man, Jigolo. <laughs> you are not a woman in Jesus' name. So you see, this Jigolo, that name I give you, Jigolo, <laughs> it's, not, it's, not an, it's not everybody that get Jigolo name. Or it's not an easy name. You are Jigolo of all nations. Now, <laughs> you know, when I hear he said, honestly speaking, guys, Immediately I heard Jigolo say, my mommy, my rich mommy. I was thinking he's talking about his mother, congrats mom. Stop calling another person's mother your mommy. If you want to say, uh -huh, my sweet mom, like my sugar mommy, just say it the way it is. My sugar mommy. Nobody's going to beat you. Eh? But I will even be happy even if you are hammered because you Jigolo, you are not in one place. Is it sugar mommy or sugar daddy or sugar baby? Or sugar, whatsoever you want to talk it, you say you are in Nairobi with Castro Castra, even though she's back on social media. You didn't bring her to show your people. That means she rejected you now. Anyway, I don't know. Maybe she will still come back. Mm -hmm. But it was too much for Castro Castra. Castro Castra said everything was too much. How do you have a girlfriend? Sometimes when I begin to ask myself, they claim they have girlfriends and they have sugar mommies all over. The sugar mummies that used to ginger them in Yabohanze. The sugar mummies that used to bring confusion for you guys. <laughs> now, all of a sudden, I was thinking, a sugar, even, even this congress mom, I don't even know whether you call her mommy. I was thinking, it's your mama in the village. I can't imagine people calling other people's mother, their mother, oh, my mother in America. And when they are talking like that, they don't realize that they are talking with international people. It's not everybody that is in Kenya that will understand your language in Kenya, whether you call people in your country, your mommies, your whatsoever. You have to know that people internationally watch you guys, and they don't call strangers their mothers. So when you say these mommies, and I go and do reaction, thinking you are talking about your mother, tomorrow people will say, a black beauty TV is a liar. Where did that lie? According to your words, don't be calling other people's mother, your mother. Say your supporter. The people will know. Your rich, rich. They don't even know the meaning of rich. They, in fact, they don't even know. You know, they just think that in their life, money is everything. That is why you see them. Oh, my rich, rich. This, this gigolo man can deceive people. I've never. In fact, I don't even know why I play your clip in my video. Because I don't want to even see your face again. But you know now, people, I don't know why you people like ginger from these people. Eh? Subscri my subscribers, you people like this ginger too much. I mean, eh, according to YouTube, YouTube said, eh, Black Beauty TV, give to your subscribers what they like to eat. That is, for me personally, eh, I don't want to be eating that kind of food. Oh. Eh, but my subscribers, you people like too much ugali. Too much ugali will not even buy you guys. Why can't we stay away from this Ugali? <laughs> I want us to fetch, uh, face another dish. I don't know whether we eat another food now. Every day we are eating Ugali, Ugali. I, I, I'm tired. Look at how Salvador is emaciated with Ugali. I don't even want to put Salvador name here. But you know, talk, talk, we'll talk. I don't even want to say that it's the Ugali. Is it the Ugali that is really emaciating Salvador? Sometimes I feel like the girl, something is wrong deep inside her like she's not feeling fine but it's not my business i don't want to talk about it again guys i think we should call it a day uh thank you for always coming to support the black beauty tv i love you guys from the depths of my heart i'm happy happy to have you guys here and we'll surely see you again in another banger have a wonderful evening it's me daughter of the soil i love you guys all bye bye no, I don't want to be at your
a party Seeing you right next to somebody Why do you keep on trying to When you know what we shouldn't do Even though that I want you Why don't we go figure it out 